So my name is Fabian Peo, I'm the CEO and co-founder of Herdwatch, which is part of FRS Network, a Armour Own Cooperative here in Roscoe. It, it, it's revolution, revolutionary in general, but not necessarily in the technology that it uses, because it's using, using technology that's, that was already available before Herdwatch. But it's how we use the technology, I think that's revolutionary, in that we took the stance, as you rightly said, a lot of people told me and us in general in the team that, look, this will never happen. Farmers will never do this. And my stance from the start, and I, I can be quoted, I'm sure, um, was that farmers ultimately are business people, just like anybody else. And if you give them a solution that allows them to make more, you know, out of the time they have, the resources they have, then they will use it. And that's really, you know, where heard what was revolutionary in, 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 in that sense. It's a journey. So it, it isn't, I wouldn't call it convincing as in, you know, you know, it's not that they're against you know, using Herdwatch or any technology. They're actually, and that's another thing that I, I think is quite amazing about uh, agriculture in general is, if you think of farmers, they're, they're the quintessential innovators. You go back thousands of years, the only innovation was around agriculture and food production. They've been doing it for thousands of years. So when people say, oh, farmers will never take up this technology or that technology, that's rubbish. They don't take, whatever they don't take up, the only reason they don't take up is because it's not built with them in mind. It's built by other people who don't understand agriculture. I think the future is gonna be a number of things. Uh, first of all, you know, more farmers on the platform and you know, we're doing that. Like I mentioned earlier, we have over 15,000 farms on the platform, which makes us the number one farm management software uh, in Ireland and the UK. Uh, we're gonna go beyond those two markets. So that's one of those things that's gonna happen over the next couple of years. Um, and then the actual pro product itself, the platform will expand to do things that it doesn't do today. I mean, you know, carbon, the carbon challenge, whatever you want to call it, the climate challenge, which is essentially about carbon, is a big uh, topic of discussion at the moment. We've all heard about it, uh, and we're going to be active in that space. How can we help? And it's all about how can we help farmers, you know, uh, navigate their way around these new challenges. It's just never ending. And I'm sure by the time this one is, you know, tackled, there'll be another one.